PBCS stores data against members of the application's dimensions. These dimensions allow data to be categorized and filtered for data entry and reporting tasks. The number of dimensions that are used will vary from application to application. However, all applications make use of six standard dimensions. Account, Entity, Period, Scenario, Version and Year. When creating the application initially, you also have the option to enable multiple currencies using one of two predefined methods for performing currency conversions. These methods will add either one or two additional dimensions, depending on the selected option, bringing the number of standard dimensions to either seven or eight. The maximum number of dimensions that can be used in a PBCS application is 20, meaning that in standard, non-multi-currency applications, up to 14 custom dimensions can be added to tailor the application to better meet your requirements. This may include tracking customers, departments, products, or any number of other business-specific details. In reality, most applications rarely use more than 12 dimensions in total. When creating new dimensions or extending existing ones, each member has a variety of properties that can be set, which will change the behavior of the member's data. Some properties are common across all dimensions, such as storage options or the ability to add aliases or descriptions alongside original member names. Other properties are dimension specific, such as choosing account types for the account dimension or choosing the range of open time periods for data entry, which is done against members of the scenario dimension. These properties provide control over the application's appearance and behavior and allow you to customize how data is stored, aggregated and displayed. When customizing your application by adding additional dimensions, there are some considerations that you should bear in mind. Firstly, adding additional dimensions can potentially make your existing application simpler and more intuitive to use. In some cases, details may be moved out of standard dimensions and into new custom dimensions, meaning that the original dimensions require fewer members. The reverse of this can also be true, however. Adding too many dimensions can make the model more complex and less intuitive to use. Balancing these requirements can lead to better performing calculations and a better structured data set that is easier to analyze.